Anyway, guys, so I made it back to the area, and now I do have a rappel on, just so I can get here faster, so it's gonna last for a little bit longer, because it was a screw rappel. Boom. Hey. Stab it. Stab it. Yeep. 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 Oh. Can I fight you at least? Yeah, we- wait, is that a Pokeball up there? So I'm totally gonna take that if it is. Okay, swimmer, right? Basculin, and four of them. Okay. I like your style. Pretty style, wish. So our Basculin's currently level 24. It's definitely catching up. I mean, it's not as good as- I mean, I- okay. The reason I said there was one spot left to fight over was because I am still planning on using Amoongus once it becomes an Amoongus. That's why it's currently even in the daycare. That's why I'm bothering to do, even do that for it. If I wasn't even want to want it, I would have just kept it on the team until now. I mean, unless one of these Pokemon are obviously superior, I'm going to keep it on the team. Okay. We're going to switch back over. Yeah, this is going to be a little bit of switch training because I would really like a lamp it as soon as possible. Because I don't know what exactly the moveset of Cobalion is. But if anything can stop Cobalion, it's going to be Jerry. And heck, only Jerry has the willpower to beat and catch Cobalion. It's going to take a lot of luck though, because we're probably going to end up having to burn Cobalion. I mean, obviously I'm going to go for my quick ball right away, but still. Okay. Just going to go for Slash, and boom, you're dead. Which we're going to keep doing. Oh, okay, you used Soak on us, which is weird, but okay. Now, this is just the primary typing of changes. So, would it just be a water fire then? If we had Litwick out against you? Because that seems kind of interesting. Jerry's level 40. Neat. Okay, I'm also just going to switch train just so we can keep getting a ton of experience on uh, Basklin because it still needs that doubling up to catch up to everyone else. Though Jerry is one level away from evolving. That is no joke, guys. Jerry is that close. Everyone on our team is 39 or higher with the exception of Basklin and, and the people in the daycare and in my PC. Which means by this point, okay, before the next episode, we're probably going to have an Amoongus on the team. I'll probably switch everyone around so we have our true team, our full team, the team that's already going to be ready to take down the Ice Gym, mind you. I mean, yes, we felt our encounter there, but that's probably a good thing. I wasn't going to use Girder anyway. The Pokemon we have now on the team is just superior to it in every way. They're also just way funner, and they don't have any real bad backstory. I mean, yeah, I should be kind of mad at Sheol being an extra duel because it killed our whole entire team, but no, I'm not. No, I press keep battle, whatever, but I'm not mad at him. He's literally become our best Pokemon. If it wasn't for him, actually, yeah, never mind. I must say, if it wasn't for him, we could get through the last flying gym, but that's not true. We beat the flying gym, we whooped the flying gym, and mostly with Litwick. I mean, yeah, we switched you in to fight all the water types. That could have killed Shield just as easily. Okay, so Shield's about to evolve. I mean, not about to evolve, but about to level up to level 40 as well. I think, yeah. So we obviously failed that one. But now we got the Deep Sea Tooth. What does it even evolve in this game? Is there a Pokemon that evolves with Deep Sea Tooth in this game? I'm kind of happy we didn't get Girder, so I might have cheated with him. To get him to evolve. Now I promise now, if we get any Pokemon that evolves off of like that, I will not even bother using it. And now, Pelfec wore off. That's just perfect timing. Wait, is this is is this a new area? It should be a new area. Uh, town map. Use Route 18. We made it, guys. New freaking area. And first we gotta fight this guy before we can even get our encounter. I have no idea what's on this island. And I kind of wish we could have gotten the egg first before we get encounter. So I'm gonna try to get to the egg as quick as possible. Just so we can keep it. Hiker Jeremiah. Okay, I don't know why I thought that, I said that very weirdly. 
Like, Jimmy and me, I dare you. You're like very weird looking for a second. Okay. Now, I know you could kill Litwick. So I'm, I'm gonna bother keeping him against you. And just go straight into Sheol. Because if anyone can handle you, it's Sheol. Okay, Sheol. It's going for Iron Defense. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. I think you still got this. You just gotta go for two earthquakes because it's sturdy. And regardless, it might just it might just stop and live because of the first one anyway. Now I think a lot of Pokemon on this island, we might just be able to like uh Girder might still be on this island though. So we might still have to catch a Girder. Or at least try to catch a Girder. As our encounter. So I know Herdier's on this island, I'm pretty sure. Like it seems like a place for Herdier. And probably Witch Hog too. It's like all the basic Pokemon's like middle evolution four slash full. And Shields reached that level. Okay, hostiles level twenty seven. Okay. Crustal. Okay. I think in the next episode, we might just straight up go for the legendary Cobalion. What the heck is Crustal though? Oh, isn't that the full evolution of the bug? Oh my goodness. Are we about to fight a Crustal? We're about to fight a Crustal, guys. I've always thought this thing was very strong. Crustal. Okay, Crustal. Let's see what moves that you have. Now, I don't want you to kill us. But I also want to fight you with Jeremy. With Jerry. Okay, in black and white. By level 34, you have Slash, Rock Slide, Stealth Rock, and Bug Bite. I'm going to give him one chance. Okay, setting up Stealth Rocks. Okay, this is your one chance. Yes, you hit him with the Inferno. Now, that might not be a one hit KO. But I really wanted to do something against Crystal. Boom. Chakalaka. Okay. I'm not saying bath glitter jokingly. Wait, this is only gonna do half. Oh ho ho. Bug bite, anyway. You thought I was gonna switch out. Just like I thought I was gonna switch out. So we're both in the clear here. And I got you with that flame burst. So now you dead. Bye, Crystal. Very strong Pokemon, mind you. Very strong. And I like it. Really too bad we can't get a Crystal out. I think we missed the one area, we got, like that's where we got sand dial or something. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna look up from about 18 just to see what we get in the second guess. Do we already have an Arduino? Wait, if we already have an Arduino, I'll just go into the grass. Okay. Arduino, where the heck are you in the Pokedex? Probably kind of far. Oh, there's our We don't have one. Okay. Route. I know I thought I wasn't going to look it up, but... Okay, Route 18, Unova. Boba Guardian. Okay. We can get some, hard, some good items here. THM for Waterfall. That's, I guess that'd be good. Okay. In Dark Rash, we can get a Crustal. Oh, yes. Though in normal grass, we can also get... Yeah, I'm not going into rustling grass, because we can get a, a crustal here, as well as just a normal dwebble. Which could be awesome to have. I think it would be awesome to get a crustal. Okay. We're not going to go into the second grass. But this might be our encounter anyway. Nope, we already have it. Get Rex on, we already got you. Thank goodness though, because I didn't I didn't want to catch I wanna catch a crustle, but I also wanted to get this egg real quick though. Okay, there's another flame burst, I should kill you. Being scraggy and all. And boom. The, the wild Pokemon here really don't give much experience. No, please, please don't, please don't. Mmm. Exactly what I wanted though. They could not have cho chosen the better Pokemon for me. Stealth Rock right away. You would have been great for the flying gym. Oh my goodness, you would have been perfect. 
But now let's catch this thing. It's so beautiful. We're running low on balls, though. We're probably gonna need more before we even go into the place to get Axel. Uh, Axew. Probably name it Axel anyway, though. Okay. We caught it. Oh, no, we didn't. It broke out. The first thing I thought it was shiny because it would seem darker than I really just the burn. Okay, so it has bug bite already. We just got a dwebble, guys. Well, hopefully we get the dwebble. Because dwebble... Crustal is one of the best Pokemon, I think, in this whole entire region. Like, I would have loved to have a shiny Crustal. Obviously, that's not going to happen, but... Eh. We got the dwebble. I might bring over some Pokemon here to train. This is a really good place, and our Pokemon could get even more OP. Okay. Dwebble. I'm naming you Tamatoa anyway. Okay, if you guys don't know who that is, you guys are really not social or watching movies. He's not a problem with movies. Tamato. Tamamota. Tamato. Tamato. Tomato? Tomato. Tamato. Ah. Let me make sure I'm spelling that right. Tamato. Tom. Tamato. Ah. Okay, I just gotta head to add a Tamatoa. Hold on, you guys. This guy's name is just gonna be Tomato. Okay, let's look at Tamatoa. Burn. He's obviously burnt right now. He's naive. And yeah, I don't know what that does. But there's something with defense. Shell armor. No critical hits. That's nice. Rock polish, bug bite, stealth rock, and rock slide. That is a clean move set. Really clean. Now I will obviously have some training to do. But this is the house with Okay. Is there a PC anywhere? Hi Pokemon Trainer. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Oh, our party's full. Mmm. I'll be right back, guys, once I get somebody out of our party. Anyway guys, so I just came back and took the Pokemon egg. Now I don't think I know Flame Body would help this, but I don't think Flame Absorb does. It actually might decrease it, which is a weird thought, but yeah. But now we have to go help get this Pokemon to evolve. I mean hatch. Okay. Okay, there's only one more place left to go now. And that's this one cave. I'll see you guys when I get around the area. Anyway guys, so now we're closing nearer to the place. I'm probably gonna put the smoke ball real quick onto uh, our boy Jerry. Just so we can get away from these Pokemon actually. Otherwise we're just gonna have to keep fighting them. Forever. So I would have really loved the rock head ability on Basquin. Because that's one of the available abilities. Which would have been fantastic because takedown would just been really good. And you guys, you guys can see these things aren't giving too much okay, experience. Give... Uh, we have a smoke ball, right? We have to have a smoke ball. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Yes, I'd like to switch two items. Lucky egg was place for smoke ball. And... Okay. That's the one problem, is that we keep running into encounters. And I really don't want to use my repels. Just because I'm that lazy, and there's the fact that we could possibly find a shiny, so I'll see you guys when we be there. Anyway guys, now we made it right outside. I am going to switch the item again. Item... Give... We're gonna give him the lucky egg, currently. Not the lucky egg. The evil light. Give him back his signature item. To catch a Pokemon. Okay, actually way farther up than I thought. But here's the evil light. Yep. I love to switch the two items. We are about to burn our enemy with, of course, will o -Wisp. How is another trash truck here? They just came by. Miss Tralton. Okay. It's really dark in here. And we just found a bull door. I'm not saying I'm mad. I'm not saying I'm extremely happy to use this. My goodness. I realized I could keep an evil light on it forever. Speaking, it would never evolve. I mean, yeah, we just missed the chance of a lifetime to get what a beautiful action we could have gotten. But now we have this. This. This boulder. 
in our life. I don't know how much better Gigalith is than you. Though it's probably quite a bit better. Okay, you're just gonna use SmackDown. That's not gonna help you much. You're just gonna keep getting burnt. I'm sorry. But I'm gonna try to catch you now. With our last Great Ball. And a bunch of Ultra Balls. If you guys get in the Great Ball, Crystal Man, Diamond Head, Diamond Head. There you go, Diamond Head, right? Snap if you said yes. He likes Diamond Head. I'm naming him Diamond Head after the Ben 10 character, obviously. And because there's diamonds coming off his head. Which is freaking awesome. He also kind of looks like a super battle droid, but I'm naming him Diamond Head. Okay. Shift this time, because I don't like seeing the not having a capital letter. Okay, guys, she just a sec what to name him. Anyway, guys, that didn't fit really, but Diamond Head, yeah, that's how we're spelling it. Now, I can't see directly how good Diamond Head. Okay, there's the cave exit. We're not gonna be coming back until at least we tell we get Flash or train our team up. I'm gonna be running around a bit, and I'll start. I guess I'll see you guys when this hatches. Okay, bye. At the end of this video, we see what the heck this egg is. If it's a Lorvesta, I'm probably never gonna use it. Bum, 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 bum. And it's our Larvesta. I started kind of putting the hints together in my mind. Relic Castle, Baby Egg. Yes. It's a girl. I'm gonna nickname her Flair. Yeah, that sounds like a good name for me. Flair. Okay. So. We got this female Larvesta. Quirky nature. Shrink shot and ember. Flame body. Mm hmm. So. I don't know if that thing's going to be on our team or not. It's probably not. But I'll see you guys, in, I'll see you guys next time for the big event and probably catch some Cobalion or get going through Twist Mountain. Bye.